All right, welcome back guys to my channel. My name is Andrew and in this video I'm gonna answer big 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 question, okay? When it comes to Forex and binary options best market hours. So in this video I'm gonna sh share you which are the best market hours in different regions, you know, uh, in order to accumulate the most profits. As you know guys, when you trade Forex or binary options or if you trade with, uh, with the auto traders as well, you know, it doesn't matter which is your auto trader that you trade, either you trade with the FX coin bot or either you trade with Binance Pro, which is complete auto trader. You still need to know which are the best market hours to trade these trading softwares in order to generate highest amount of profits and in order not to lose, uh, you know, any unnecessary trades. Because as you know guys that uh, if you trade with Binance Pro and FX Coinbot, yes they are profitable, yes they are play able to place automated trades for you, but if you trade during, you know, a night, you could lose money, you know. Uh, so make sure guys you watch this video until the end, you know, about these market hours and also at the end of the video I'm gonna share you some little little secret I haven't heard anybody else, uh, you know, t talking about when it comes to day trades So guys make sure you watch this video until the end and let's get started Right, so first things first guys, first things first, if you are new to my channel, I would highly recommend you guys to please click on that subscribe button and also please click on the ring bell button so that you will never miss any of my video news releases because I'm here for you guys, you know, because you have asked me this so many times and uh, I have answered this question actually many times in emails, but uh, I hope that, you know, uh, this video is gonna be, you know, is gonna be beneficial for all of those people who are still, you know, in questions which is the best market hours, when should I trade, when I should not trade, which are the most recommended trading hours and all. So let's get to it. So Forex market hours, guys. So either if you trade with Bind, Bind Pro Auto Trader or if you trade with FX CoinBot uh, trading software or if you're a manual trader, uh, you know, or you're, if you trade options, you know, you need to understand, guys, uh, which are the, the mar Forex market hours, uh, you know, and how they change and, you know, and for where it starts. So let's get to it, guys. So Forex market hours vary for each region, okay, which has its own official opening times. Here are the best times to trade each uh, each major currency pairs and why. So, uh, let me click here. So here we go. So this is the this is the global map right here. So New York time. So New York time is uh, a market a market hours hours from for New York is one o'clock to ten o'clock. Pay attention, guys. I am talking about where I am located at the moment in the UK. So I'm talking about UK time. Uh, so this is about UK time. So. Um, you, you, UK is not at the moment GMT plus one, so this is the U, uh, this is the UK time. Uh, so uh, if you want to know what are these times for your country, so you know, so simply you know, simply take your country time zone uh, and uh, and the UK time zone and see how many hour difference is between your time zone and uh, and the UK time zone, and then uh, calculate what are these times in your time zone. So for example. So for example, this is my time right now, five past, uh, five past four, okay? Uh, I'm living in GMT plus one time zone. Uh, so this is the time, uh, you know, for this time. So I could use this time uh, as it is. But if you are from different country, okay? Let's say, for example, if you are from Abu Dhabi, okay? Um, again, I'm just picking, you know, randomly, guys. You know, I was thinking which, which should I pick, you know? Because, for example, in Abu Dhabi, in Abu Dhabi at the moment it's uh, 5 past 7. In Abu Dhabi the time is GMT plus 4. As you can see here, uh, this is displayed for, from the Google search. So GMT plus 4. Uh, so this will mean that these times will be... Let me go back. So, uh, this, so this is the UK time. So if the UK time is GMT plus 1, means that the all of these times for my case would be all of this time plus one hour. So New York trading hours for me, for my UK time will be 14 hours to 23 hours. London trading hours will be nine o'clock until six o'clock. Sydney hours for me would be 23 hours until eight o'clock. And Tokyo trading hours for me would be one o'clock at night until 10 o'clock in the morning. If you are from Abu Dhabi, which is GMT plus four, okay, um, these you know GMT plus four, 
This will mean that you will need to. And these are the UK local times, GMT plus one. So you will need to plus three hours. So due to the fact that the UK is GMT plus one, this is GMT plus four minus one hour. That will gonna be three hours. So that's gonna be a difference of three hours. So if you live in Abu Dhabi, uh, your trading hours will be for the New York session uh, four o'clock, uh, four o'clock until eleven o'clock uh, until uh, sorry until one o'clock, uh, eleven o'clock until 8 o'clock for London Sydney trading hours will be uh, 1 o'clock until 10 o'clock and Tokyo trading hours would be quite bizarre which would be uh, 3 o'clock in the, from from 3 o'clock in the morning until uh, 12 o'clock uh, in uh, midday okay yeah but uh, but honestly guys you know so there are New York trading hours London trading hours and uh, Tokyo and Sydney it's best, you know, if, if you go to your country, if you go to Google search and say, uh, click on London trading hours, okay? And they're gonna share, you know, they, they, they're gonna show you directly, okay? You can go to worldtimezone.com, you know, and check specifically, you know, uh, which markets are open and closed for you. But this is just, you know, if you have resources, you know, if you, if you can open a website, you know, but uh, honestly, guys, so worldtimezone.com is going to share, show you specifically for your time so that you will not get confused. This is for newbie traders, okay? Because I really don't want to get anybody confused because trading hours, guys, is really, really important. But uh, well, I mean, in my case, I know this by heart, you know, already because so it, now uh, the UK is GMT plus one. Now then, then will, there will be a winter time, which is going to be GMT. So it's going to be another, another again one hour less. But for if you guys are still confused, simply use worldtimezone.com. And let's move on, guys. So best uh, best time to trade each of the major currency pairs. During these official hours, um, trade hours trading is most active in that regions. I'm talking about uh, here, okay? Uh, associated currency and does it? It is the best time to trade each of the major currency pairs. So London session is for a GBP against Euro, New York session is about USD against other currencies, Sydney is AUD, Australian dollar, and Tokyo is obviously Japanese yen, you know. Uh, yeah, so let's move on. Uh, again, this is a nice little table, you know, uh, if you can, if you want to have a screenshot of this, you can save it and, and, and put it as a picture on your phone or whatever, it's just so that you will always remember what's, which are the, your training hours. So again, so for for for, for British, British pounds six. So this is exactly that we just talked about, but just in, in a table format. I mean, I know some people, you know, are uh, have you know are, are getting easier to understand when they are when they have a table when it comes to time zones. So it's up to you guys. So yeah. Anyway, so trading prime time. Uh, trading prime time is is this, this is the time that I was usually uh, talking about. Uh, when it comes to best trading hours, for example, with the, some of the trading softwares, you know. So the prime time uh, suggested by the book. So these are the times by the book. Well, in my case, you know, I am usually saying that the, that the best trading hours are 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. GMT. 9 a.m. 7 p.m. GMT. So I'm kind of, I'm, I'm giving, these are just kind of out of the box, okay? So I'm thinking out of the box because morning sessions before 12 o'clock GMT sometimes could be extremely lucrative. Uh, until 7 o'clock, it's too dangerous, yes, uh, because, you know, it's not recommended to trade after 5 o'clock. Again, this is GMT, uh, GMT plus one times so, or GMT time, you know. Uh, in winter GM this is a GMT time we are talking about guys so one o'clock until five o'clock is considered to be the best prime time to trade again if you're using a uh, auto traders or or semi-automated trading signals or if you're trading manually yourself uh, uh, please make sure guys that you uh, you know you understand that this is the best hour so one o'clock until five o'clock that's actually four hours you know four hours and uh, these are the best four hours in every single day. Monday to Friday, obviously, because Forex markets are closed over weekends, okay? Um, yeah, so this is, so if you're a newbie trader, if you want to be really, really secure about your profits, and we, when you're wondering which are the best, best times to trade, these. And uh, now, let's move on. 
Uh, this is because the great British pound and the euro are all being traded alongside, of course, and against the US dollar and, of course, the popular Canadian CAD and uh, Swiss franc. Swiss franc is, 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 is like a baby. It's like a... Swiss franc is so amazing, you know, it's like a forex baby. Whatever happens in the world, you know, uh, crashes, global crashes, economical crashes, you know, mumbo jumbo, uh, you know, Swiss franc will be also always like a kind of a baby, sleeping and slowly, slowly growing, you know. And that's amazing. That's why because you know, because investor and institutional investors, you know, are are, are putting all their commodities in in in, in Switzerland. Uh, yeah. Now, guys, at the end of this video, listen up. There is there is going to be a little little secret, okay? Which again is from the book, but I haven't seen anybody on the YouTube or any other. Uh, the channels or websites actually talking about this okay so listen up guys pay attention during the first hour of each of the uh, regions that we just talked about as it is considered the most active for that regions associated currency as traders respond out of our out of hours events so so basically what if you don't understand don't worry what is all this about is that uh, let's go back okay these hours best trading hours guys are for is the first hour after each uh, region is uh, you know has its uh, tra you know, tra trading open whenever whenever markets open first hour is the most lucrative most volatile um, the best to tra time to trade is the first hour i know some of the prof professional traders who trades over over 10 years only trade the first hour of the you know of the trading sessions first hour of the of, of the, when the markets are open and then then they do nothing for the rest of the day so first hour for the new york will be the best trading hours will be from one o'clock to two o'clock for London, it will be 8 o'clock until 9 o'clock. For Sydney, it will be at 10 o'clock until uh, 11 o'clock at night, beginning, okay? And for the Tokyo, it will be uh, 12 o'clock at night until 1 o'clock in the morning. So these uh, the, these four regions, the best hour, the best training time is the first hour, the most volatile. But again, guys, make sure that you watch the charts and fundamentals and make sure you know what you are doing. Yeah, guys, so thanks guys for watching this video. Please, please like and subscribe. If you have any questions, you, you're welcome to email me. Trade safely, trade responsibly, and always remember that education and practice is the, is the key for long-term success. If you're looking for a, a profitable auto trading, service, auto trading software or semi-auto trading uh, service, then I will leave them below the video in the description box where we, we have some safe and profitable alternatives for you guys to use if you're a newbie trader and you're looking for automated trading instead of manual trading. Thanks guys and see you again next time. Bye!